Armstrong Magnetics offers two models of battery-activated electro-permanent lifting magnet that have rated lifting capacities of 3,000 and 6,000 pounds for flat loads with safety factor of 3. They integrate an inside battery and use electricity for less than one second to be activated and deactivated. EPB series are designed to be easily controlled from both the control panel on the main body and a remote control from a distance. On the front control panel, there are a few important functional buttons to ensure the highest operational safety and ability to adjust lifting capacity. MAG, the top left green button is for partial magnetization and followed by full magnetization a few seconds after the load is being lifted off the ground. Adjust the lift capacity is the bottom left knob, adjustable to min, mid, and max lifting capacities. D-Mag and Unlock D-Mag are the two buttons in the middle of the control panel. They must be pressed simultaneously to demagnetize the EPB and release the load. Similarly, there are three buttons on the remote control, namely MAG, DMAG, and Unlock DMAG, to accurately control the lifting job at a distance. Now, we'll show you the simple steps of operating EPB. First, inspect the lifting magnet before usage. Clean the surfaces of your load and magnet poles. Any gap created by dust, paint, or uneven surfaces between the load and the EPB can dramatically decrease the EPB rated lifting capacity and put your employee at risk. Step 2. Press the power button and the red light will now be turned on. Step 3. Press the MAG button. The light for partial MAG will be switched on along with an intermittent alarming sound, indicating the lifting magnet now has partial lifting capacity. Step 4. A few seconds after the lifting magnet is lifted off the ground, both the light for partial mag and the intermittent alarm will be off, and meanwhile the light for mag will be switched on, indicating the lifting magnet has reached its full lifting capacity. Full lifting capacity must be achieved before any lifting job. Stop the lifting job whenever any indicators continue to flash and or a continuous alarm begins to sound. There is a special safety interlock designed between hoisting and demagnetization. The lifting magnet cannot be demagnetized while it is lifted off the ground or the hoist rope is under tension. Step 5. After the lifting magnet and the load have been placed on the ground, press DMAG and unlock DMAG buttons simultaneously to release the load. We also offer a remote control for users to easily manage the hoisting task away from the load. Procedure using the wireless remote control is exactly the same as controlling the unit at its control panel, and all safety practices must be followed to avoid any damage to your employee and equipment. Armstrong has also designed safety warnings for any insufficient magnetization or demagnetization. If a partial magnetization, full magnetization, or demagnetization has any issues, a continuous alarm will sound and or a light for partial mag, full mag will be flashing. When using this equipment, safe operating practices must be conducted. Always gently and smoothly lift, move, and lay down the lifting magnet and its load. Absolutely no vibration or impact can be applied onto the lifting magnet during hoisting. Never stand under any lifting load. Keep the lifting path clear at all time. Thank you for watching this video on Armstrong's Electro Permanent Lifting Magnet. For more information on operational procedure, safety, special features, or technical inquiry of our products, please visit www.armsmag.com.